how to connect twitter or x to an attend hey everyone welcome back to the channel in today's video i will show you how to connect twitter or x to an attend and automate your tweets perfect for marketer social media manager or content creator who wants to save time and post smarter way now let's get started first thing first uh, let's before we jump in you will need a few things a twitter developer account and the second, a Twitter app created inside the project and oath credentials. It means client ID and client secret. Now, if you click on it and if you go into create new credential, as you can see here, there are two options like client ID, they need and client secret. So we will going to get that. Now, what you have to do is just simply click on this open docs from your Anaton and as you can see here, you have to have X developer account. So what I'm going to do is just simply just for this tutorial, I will create an account in X. So this is my new account, which I'm going to use. So this is that account. And now what I'm going to do is create a developer account. Just simply click on this option or you can search developer.x.com from here. In the top right corner, there is an option of developer portal. Click on that. And it will take you to this page where from here, you will get to see this kind of interface in front of you. So this is my old account. So just let me sign out and sign in again with my new account. So you get the better understanding. So again, I have to go back and click on this X developer and now click on this developer portal. Now over here, I have to enter all the information. Like, as you can see here, they have a lot of plans like write 300 per month, filter stream API and basic lot of things, right? If you have a bit, if you get the basic plan, you can get. Now I will sign up for free. Just simply click on it. Now describe all of your use cases of Twitter's data and API. So I will just add some reason why I want this developer portal. So I'm making this tutorial on how to connect X with an attend work an attend node. So it must be have at least 250 character or long. So what I'm going to do is just simply go into chat GPT. Now, as you can see here, there are three options. You have to tick on that. You understand that you may not resell anything you receive via the Twitter APIs and all of those things. And you accept the terms and condition. Click on the submit button and wait for a few seconds. As you can see here, we are in the developer portal of X and now from there in the left side, there is a navigation bar into that you have an option of projects and app click on that. And then you have to click on this default project. This is the app. So as you can see here and click on this option into that app. Now what you have to do is this is our app name. And if you want to change the app name icon from here, you can change it from here. So this is I, I, app ID. So you don't need to these things. So what you need is just simply click on this setup button. Now, what you have to do is give a app permission. If you give, it will read post and profile information only. So you have to choose read and write. So it will read and post and profile information. So, and if you choose read and write and direct message, so it will read post and profile information and read and post direct messages so you can just simply choose the read and write or you can choose a read and write and direct message as well so in the app type you have to choose web app and from here you have to uh, enter the url which we are going to take from this uh, from anaton so this is auth redirect url so it will redirect the request so just paste it over here and in the website URL, what you have to do is just paste this much and yeah, there we go. 
now you have to just whatever you don't need to fill out this form because these are some optional organized url terms and salvation options and click on the save so changing permission might affect your app are you sure you want to change the permission yes just simply click on this yes now we get the client id and the client secret so just copy this and paste it into your uh, node and again copy the client secret and click on it now after entering all of these client id and client secret you will get disconnect my account button just simply click on it and as you can see in the right side we have credentials successfully has been created now what you have to do is sign in sign in as with your account so click on it and it will ask you to authorize your account with Anaton. So just sign up with the Google first and wait for a few seconds. Uh, over here, you have to enter the username. So my username, if you go into profile, so this is my username. Just copy this and paste it. Oh, okay. Copy this and paste it over here into username. And then what you have to do is just enter the password, I guess. Maybe it will ask the password. Okay, we have successfully logged in into our x.com into an attend. So what you have to do is just simply connect my account again. And it will ask the authorization of your app and click the authorization. So, so as you can see here, the connection has been done successfully. This window will close in five seconds. So this is how you can connect your Twitter account with your Anaton node. So let's say, let's try this. This is our username and let's execute this step. So there is a problem with the API to be either basic go. So as you can see here, it is working very well and it is taking the, the what do you call the request taking? Now, yeah, that's how you can create a connection between Twitter known as X and between Anaton. So if you want to know how to make workflow, how you can create an automation workflow, just comment it down. I will make video on that. So if this helped you like this video, subscribe and drop your question. Or if you have automation ideas, comment it down. I will make it for you. Thanks for watching.